So what's your philosophy on pacing? Um, I think for most people who play saxophone or anything else, I think the challenge is not to be boring and not to um, say too much too soon. Um, I have a philosophy. I, I always ask my students to watch black preachers or white preachers who are charismatic or who are Protestant because they really know how to tell a story. If you go to a black church or even you know, a white church now, because a lot of them you know, um, uh, were doing it, um, the first thing the preacher says if he's real good is he'll say, he'll start in a very low voice. Um, today, um, we study from the text of James. Now you know that he can really hit you with that loud screaming thing and, 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 and you know the, the, the spirit's going to come down from the sky and women are going to start rolling over the pews and people are going to start jumping. It's going to be a party going on in about 15 minutes. But the way he starts it is, saints, please turn to page. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's the pacing of it. So he starts you out. The, the beauty of it is the way he starts the sermon not the way he finishes it. So he takes you all the way through these gyrations and these movements, but he starts very, very slow. Making love is the same thing. When you talk about, if you start your pacing at about 10, well, the experience is going to be very quick for you and your partner, and I'm not so sure that's the kind of you know message you want to send to her. So the fact of the matter is that when you can combine those type of, of elements, like with the sex and the religion, and, and put that into you, that me, when I'm playing or when I'm doing an improvisation, I consider it an intimate relationship with my audience. If I peak too soon, that's bad. If I wait too long, that's bad. So what I try to do is control the improvisation, control the performance, so that when I let them have it and they know it's coming, it's just like a good preacher on Sunday morning. You know, I control it. And then once you let them have it and, it, and, and it's done the way it's done properly, they'll come back to see you all the time. And they'll pay money to do it. 